Alright, today guys, hole number four here of the tournament. Just gonna try to blast this down as far as possible. About three rings here. I'm gonna be able to apply my curl. Don't want to run into this tree here. So you can see, I'm just gonna try to play it dead straight. Just let the wind effect carry this out into the fairway. As you can see, another short hole here where we can avoid playing the ball. So anytime that you can avoid using balls for the better. Can't believe landed on this upslope, it still rolls out the way that it does. But I know why, it's the uphill nature of this hole. So we'll have to be a little bit cautious with our play. I'm gonna do the max here. Which is going to put me at, no, not quite max. I'm going to do definitely towards mid. 585. Five, five. Six rings tops. And then additionally, we're going to pull back. In fact, that's a, those are kind of our reasons to kind of under pull since we're pulling back towards min again. I do think that this green is going to very hard slope, as you can see, really falling off the table there. Oh, and just on the fringe. Can't believe, because I went all those rings, and then the wind effect and slope there really kicked that down. So the early clubs, as you can see, not the most easy to play with. So all I'm going to do on these typically is just try to dunk them. Assuming you get your ultimate shot, it's going to go in. Um, it's kind of like a safety measure for early clubs with low ball guide. So as you can see, we can at least sacrifice. Unfortunately, you know, all that slope pushed me off the green. But, uh, you know, still able to salvage it. So good luck there. I'll see you guys on the next.